I'm from the island of St. Lucia, which is next to Barbados. It's a little dot on the map. My dad was a prime minister, yeah. He was a very interesting man. He passed away. Um, but he led St. Lucia to independence from England. So we've been independent for 39 years because of my dad. Imagine that. <laughs> My grandmother was always in the kitchen cooking and just bossing people around and telling people what to do and don't do this and don't do that and this is how you cut this. And I just, I just admired her from afar, you know, and when I started cooking, we, we became very close. You know, I was like her sous chef in the kitchen um, as I was growing up cooking. Nina was working in Miami for a long time. She was number two underneath Scott Conan, who's a very well-known Italian chef. And you can really see some of that influence in the food that she's doing. When you think about my food, you guys know that that's Nina Compton on a plate. I think most people came to know Nina through her appearance on Top Chef, where she really um, was a contestant that people fell in love with. You can come from a small island and make it to the finale on Top Chef, and anything's possible. And if you loved her on Top Chef, you'll probably love the food that she's cooking at Compare Le Pen as well. In New Orleans, Nina Compton is doing great things. Her Compare Le Pen opened in 2015, and she has been crushing it with this sexy combination of bayou and Caribbean, all with the flair that only she could provide. I got a chance to do my own restaurant in New Orleans, which I always wanted to live there. And I said, why not? So I just picked up everything and I moved. When you get to New Orleans, it's like being in, in the Caribbean. And you see French influence, British influence, Portuguese, um, slavery, a lot of slave influence as well. So for me, that's something that I grew up with. I'm like, this is, this is fun, this is my playground. I'm like, I'm just gonna make it everything I grew up with and, and much more. So that's, that's the whole premise of the menu. The menu is a little bit of everything. Caribbean influence, but also French, Italian. And I try and basically make it fun. So we add a lot of Cajun and Creole ingredients as well. And it's almost like she's got this like rubber band ball of like what Louisiana cooking truly is. And she's like unraveling it and looking at all of its parts in this really interesting way. From Compare La Pain in New Orleans, Nina Compton. When it got announced, I had so many of my peers, people I respect in the industry saying, congratulations, you know, your life is gonna change. And I'm like, what does this all mean? What is the meaning of life? Like what's gonna happen next? So for me, it, it's, it's like the next step is going to be, I think, a fun journey. You know, it's, it's just going to get bigger and better, I think. Yeah.